Hey, it's your girl G with Making Memories 8. And we're going to two places today. We're going to Costco and Walmart to do some grocery hauls. My intention at Costco is just to get pick up a few things. We're just going to get pick up some produce, something simple, and then I have to head over to Walmart picking up the filler items that I can't get at Costco, like the chips, be looking at some undergarments, that, that would be for myself. So if you're interested in looking at this haul, if those are some things that you like, then stay tuned. Come on, bub. It's third. Oh, Roku streaming media is $9.99. So they have this here, the four tier basket for $34.99. So I'm here in the produce section in the refrigerated area here at Costco, excuse me. But the prices here are seem a little bit more pricier than Sam's Club. My husband's gonna go tomorrow and check out their stuff. I only came in here because I was craving some produce, like some strawberries. And the price for organic strawberries is $5.49. And then if you're okay with just regular strawberries, it's $4.99. We're gonna go with organic. Organic. prices here for me. I re recently bought some brisket. This one here is $3.99 a pound for the brisket. This isn't trimmed. You'll just have to trim it yourself. So here, the ground beef is 88% lean, 12% fat. I'm gonna divide this up. So right now it is comes out to 24.42. So I was shopping online and I noticed that these were on sale, at least the Tide, some of the detergent. Let me take a look and see. We also have the Tide with Downy and that's for 150. So it's about almost 20 cents per load if you follow the 110 loads. So some of the popcorn here, they have it for 20, 30 cents each. And it comes with 44 bags. So the kids really like this popcorn. So I've been doing this YouTube thing really mainly, probably really being serious about this in the last few months. And I truly feel like this is a hard goal to pursue. Maybe because I'm just a boring, a boring person. Don't have like that live, vivacious personality. Um, I'm, I'm pretty calm. So it's hard to reach out to those people that uh, probably get bored with this type of content. Cohen's gonna be helping me trying to open up this plastic bag. It's, it's like a trash bag. Yeah. So you know how to pick tomatoes? No, you can't just grab them. You eat them right away. Hey, don't squeeze them too much. Here, start putting them in the bag. Which one? I'm gonna start putting them in the bag. Okay, I think we have enough. 
That's enough. Uh oh, oh, no, hold on. Look at this one you picked. No, I would not pick that one. So here the avocados are $1.08. So the pineapples here are $1.78. Oh, I'm And as far as, usually what I'll do is I'll buy it like this and then I'll turn it upside down. Leave it on my kitchen pantry when we're ready to eat, I mean our, our kitchen counter when we're ready to eat it. So this one looks good for $1.78. So here they have the mangoes for 78 cents each. Let me see. Okay, that one's good. Yeah, let's go. So they have the cucumbers here for 60 cents each. This is actually a pretty good size for the cucumbers that I've seen compared to some other Walmarts that I've been to. Cohen's trying to help me out here. So they have these here for $1.98, the cantaloupes. Sometimes I notice when you're here at Walmart, you gotta watch for the expiration. So they have this white chicken Caribbean celery with pecans. That one's pretty good. They also have some different types of chicken salad, buffalo style, southern style. and then rotisserie. Right now they got their, chick their chicken on sale. So they have the lemon pepper one. So you can make chicken salad. And never pass up the cakes, especially in the morning. Sometimes you can find some cakes on sale. So, if you ever need to shop for cakes, that's what I've done in the past too. Now, so the watermelon is three ninety eight. All right, so I'm gonna grab one. <laughs> So the kids like eating these Slim Jims. This is a quick snack. I don't know why the bags feel like, seem like they're smaller. Or is that just me? great value. Man, it seems like a lot of their tops are messed up. Look at that. I'm looking for this other flower. flower that I like to get is at King William. I'm not showing that they have any. Looks like they are out. I'll have to go with this one for $2.97. Okay. 
y'all y'all want to come check out walmart right now they are having a big huge clearance section of clothes let me show you what they got so they have fall stuff they have cute pieces here some dresses if you're going out let's see they got this shirt marked down from $17.98 to $3 they have some of these summer tees for four bucks they also have some of these skirts this reminds me of that clueless skirt they have these here for five dollars marked down from $14.88 98 some terry cloth shorts for seven bucks and they even got your hoochie mama <laughs> hoochie mama shorts they're cute shorts i can't wear them like i used to so anyways these here are marked down to 12. lots to come and see Tons of stuff. I haven't even, I just looking at briefly a tiny snippet. Check out your local Walmart store where you're at. Oh, look at this. They got kids' clothes too. Some of this justice stuff. Seven bucks. Seven coins. Mm hmm. Uh oh. We also have this right here, which is clear your mind, $3. I have a Mickey Mouse hoodie. How much is this for $12.50? A lot of cute stuff. Man, I love these type of bras. The bralettes because they're comfortable and easy to put on definitely makes it a nice they're just nice and they give me the nice um, lift that I like they have definitely a lot of good bras here they also have this one here which I like these like sports bra type bras smooth underarm bulge but I say definitely don't miss the opportunity of passing up these bras and underwear here at Walmart. They have so many options. Like here they have some of these made in form now with cooling. If you're trying to get your form on, oh, let's see how much they are here. That has the price. I'm not seeing the price right off the bat. So I am finishing up I'm going to show you everything that I purchased. This is an overall of what I got from Walmart and Sam's Club. I spent roughly about $241. Oh, $99.55 is what I spent at Walmart. And then at Costco, I spent $141 at Costco. So I'm going to show you everything here. I, I, I don't have it broken up by groups. So we got this from Costco. This is their butter croissants, 12 count for $5.99. This one was the one for $3.99, the ground beef 88% lean. I did get this at Walmart for $3.98. Those were on sale. It was actually more expensive at Costco. I got some vegetable oil from Walmart. We did get the Slim Jims, that's, that's already been broken into. Cohen's favorite, which is the pistachios with the seeds. Also, we got some popcorn, that's really good. Have some lemons here. Lemons are, I got these from, from um, Costco and these were like, what, $5.99? Nice. So also, I'm trying out this cilantro lime shrimp. This is for $13.63. It's at $10.99 a pound, so I'm going to try that and see if that's good. 
I have some of these um, mangoes from, can't even think for a moment here, mangoes and strawberries. I also got some cucumbers over there. I like to cut all the fruit up and we like to drizzle it with some chamoy and some uh, tahine or whatever chili powder you like. We like going to the Alamo Candy store here in San Antonio and it's very, tastes very good. I'll show you that here in another video. I also got some strawberries from Costco. I got this. This is to help with the produce. I usually have some produce and I'm wanting, I don't have a lot of space. I'm gonna try to do a pantry tour, really show you what it looks like in my pantry. Um, but I got this, this is to, to have all the vegetables, maybe the onions sitting out to where things that I don't have a spot on the shelf, I can have at least a basket for it where it's easy to get to. And then, Hold on, Bubby. Yes, I will. Yes. I also got these lemon pepper from Walmart. Originally $6.97. This was for $4.39. I'm going to shred that up and make some rotisserie. I'm sorry, some chicken salad sandwiches. Atlas was requesting these Flamin' Hot Limon Doritos. He really loves those. Since the kids are home, snack snacks. Love those snacks. I got some salads for some quick meals. I got this this one, it's the Caesar salad. We also have the Fiesta salad with chicken. And then the last bit here, which is the apple and walnut salad. So I always say when you're buying something from Walmart specifically, you just wanna check to make sure things haven't expired. I'm running out of flour. I wanted to make some pizza, but it didn't have enough flour to make pizza. So got some all-purpose flour from Walmart. Also have some avocados here. And then these cucumbers, these were 60 cents each at Walmart. Grapefruit is outrageous at Costco. I think they're probably just really expensive. Charlotte's trying to show you her Thing she's got going on there. I like to, uh, mommy, after this video, mommy's gonna uh, peel uh, it. Yeah, and I like it with the spices. <laughs> so I got some grapefruit. I like the large grapefruit. This was over six dollars at Costco. And then we got some Reynolds wrap, the heavy duty that had a four dollar off coupon. Let's see, I also got some Roma tomatoes there at Walmart. And then Holly wanted to try out these cinnamon twist marshmallows, which she said tastes like the gum, which I did not clarify what she meant. Um, overall, that's, oh, and a bag of potatoes, which is sitting over there. That's, that's pretty much it. Let me see how big this bag of potatoes is. 15 pounds. Oop, I need to turn this down. So I'm going to close out this chapter. It is really hot out there. Here in San Antonio, it is 98 degrees. Um, lately, it's been over 100, which up to 106, and that's a little abnormal for our area it's crazy here but overall i wanted to thank you for joining me on our grocery haul i know i'm trying to be better about uploading videos trying to gain that consistency but otherwise we are a family of eight if you love grocery hauls thrift store hauls shopping in general eating we're foodies here as well we do a little bit of traveling as well uh, for a large family. We try to show you tips and tricks on how to save money. It's important, especially in this crazy economy that we're living in. But nonetheless, we wanna thank you. And as always, please take care of yourself and each other. And we are signing out. Take care, bye.